Hello friends, you welcome back. And today I am again with another case of root canal treatment of the mandibular first molar tooth and the mandibular second premolar tooth. As the patient visits to me that he told me that he is having a lot of uh, pain since the last one month and the patient is taking the medicine from the local pharmacist to relieve his tooth pain. And when the patient visits to our clinic, I see the two big carious lesions on the two teeth on the both uh, mandibular first molar tooth and the mandibular second premolar tooth. So I told the patient that he should not have taken uh, this much of medicine since one month. After that, I discussed the treatment part with the patient that in both the teeth, we have to go for the root canal treatment and your problem will be definitely solved. So the patient told me, okay, uh, you can go ahead with this. So I stopped the root canal treatment of both the teeth. Let's have a look of this case. This is the preoperative radiograph of the patient where you can see the uh, carious lesion at the mandibular second premolar tooth and the mandibular first molar tooth. Uh, this is at the contact area, that's the interproximal area, and the both the teeth are involved, and which causes discomforts to the patient. You can also see that the uh, patient has done the root canal treatment of the uh, second molar tooth also. You can see that very well, uh, but the canals are not very well prepared. So after that, uh, I start my root canal treatment and I prepare all the canals, I shape all the canals. This is the working length radiograph. Where you can see that in the mandibular second premolar tooth, and there's a single canal uh, that's very well shaped. And in the mandibular first molar tooth, uh, the three different canals are there. And in the mesial root, there are the two separate canals, which ends into the two separate foramens. And in the distal root, there is only one separate canal. So this is my final radiograph. This is a distal view radiograph, where you can see all the three well prepared canals in the mandibular first molar tooth. This is the mesiobuccal canal, this is the mesiolingual canal, and this is the distal canal. In the mesial root, you can see the two separate canals, which ends into the two separate foramens. And in the second premolar tooth, this is the single well obturated canal. So once I did obturation, I restored the tooth with the temporary cement, that's the glossinoma cement, and the permanent restoration is to be done in the next appointment. My advice for everyone that if you have some dental issues, please and please go to your dentist. Do not go to the quacks, do not go to the local pharmacist. They may give you the medicines that may relieve pain for some time, but that medicine is not going to do you good for the long period. Go to your dentist and get your problems solved. I hope this video is helpful for you. If you like the video, please do subscribe my YouTube channel. This is Dr. Roop and see you in the next one.